In the former imperial city of Delhi, the Union Jack flies again in honor of a guest. In Delhi's streets, the world of today rubs shoulders with the day before yesterday. Among the carts and the saloon cars, you can still see the sacred cattle whom no Hindu will disturb. But many things have changed. The Viceroy's house is now the official home of the President. A guard of honor mounted by the Lancers adds to the dignity of a reception for Britain's Premier Harold Macmillan, who arrives with Mr. Nehru. Vice President Radhakrishnan waits with his guests for the arrival of the President, Dr. Rajendra Prasad, with his ADCs. The President greets Lady Dorothy and Mr. Macmillan. Guests of many races are here to honor the British visitors, including representatives of the European churches in India. Harold Macmillan has achieved a great personal success with the government and people of India partly because he represents the Indian's idea of a typical Englishman with his gift for mixing ceremony and informality. Lady Dorothy shares this success, which has increased understanding between our two peoples. 